Hello, this is uh, ICR Tiger from thetradingtigers.com. Today I'm going to present to you about the United States dollar uh, against the CAD dollar on the monthly and daily time frames uh, looking at the Elliott Wave analysis. Uh, please do go back and look at the uh, previous slides in terms of the disclaimer and the hypothetical performance. Please do stop and lead, read at your leisure. Okay, let's kick it off now. Okay, for, so here we're looking at the um, monthly time frame of the United States against the CAD dollar. And um, what we're looking at, we're looking at our Elliott Wave analysis, which is telling us uh, specifically that we've started our um, main uh, count at 0.0, .0 on um, 2002 in January. And um, the um, uh, uh, Wave 1, it's Wave 1, the, the degree cycle, uh, closed on 2007. So it's a five year move it took to, to, to complete its five waves. There's one, two, three, four, and five came down there. And its uh, sub moves are the um, uh, primary, which are red um, in circle, and the intermediate, it is sub wave which is um, in green and in brackets so just giving you a little bit more of uh, uh, detailed information so um, the the cycle degree has finished its wave 2 which came here and that date it finished it on was uh, March 2009 and um, there uh, reaching to the 61.8 um, level and we're taking it down now to its wave 3. We've projected its wave 3 to come down here to 59.32 um, 59 and if we look in terms of a pip value from current price um, that is quite significant but from current price take it down we're looking at about 5,000 pips Yes, but 5,000 pips is from here to here is not going to come uh, immediately. It's going to take some time to get down there, but we're going to be in and out of trades all the way till we get to this particular level. That's going to be the safe level. It's going to take, as you can see, a number of years before we can get down to there. Um, but our overall um, bias is on the bearish uh, for this particular pair. And uh, what we're looking down now into a further kind of uh, moves down. Um, so it's uh, necessary sub waves um, of the of the primary wave is in its wave three, right? So it finished its one, two, three, and um, the intermediate we want the wave one to start to begin uh, to start to to drop down okay let's move uh, now to the um, daily chart okay fine so this is an overall deeper longer picture off um, the daily chart of what we can see so you can have a better understanding what are we really looking at and how are we anticipating anything to happen um, so you can see it's wave two up here which was on January the 30th um, this year okay and uh, we we're looking for its sub wave of the intermediate to come down to here <clears throat> but within there of course it's the minor waves um, which will start filling up um, um, to start to give us a, an overall perspective for uh, potential trades um, within so that's um, all I can say for now. My name's uh, ICR Tiger from Avert Trading Tigers. Thank you.